Dave, a 1-0, 1-0 win, we go up to second, you know, just give me your overall analysis of this afternoon. Delighted to win, um, delighted to win a, a really, really tight game. Again, I had a feel of a, a playoff game about it, um, again, with all the crowd not being in here, we didn't have that atmosphere, but we knew it would be a tough game today um, against a really, really good side that are in the division on merit, in, in the division, or the place they are in the division on, on merit. Um, so. We knew it would be tight, we knew it would be cagey, we knew how they would play, the threat on the counter attack and they're pretty, um, the front four are, are a real handful. We had to deal, deal with that, um, but even when we've not played as maybe we want to play in terms of our open, free-flowing type of, type of football, that's realistic to what this league is. And you've got to win them type of games and probably if, if like, there's a criticism of us as a club and, and, and maybe of um, my teams a little bit is that we don't win enough of those type of type of games. Last week was a, was a game similar to that, a, a game where a team have, have, have tried to stop us. They've scored from a set piece. Thankfully today we've scored from a, from a set piece and it's, it's won us the game. But apart from that, like I say, I knew the back five would have to defend really, really well, but they did that. Um, OT and Luke were a massive threat. Like I said, the moments in the game that you hope don't come back and bite you. Um, two real good chances from straight balls, flick ons, and we're in on we're on goal. And on another day, you know, you'd expect or, or hope OT and, um, and Luke would would give themselves a, another goal. Um, aside from that, I thought we managed the, managed the game really well and, and, and put our bodies on the line in order to get three points. Just talking about the goal, it was, it was such an end to end game, a really good game for the neutrals and they really came out the second half attacking and we've gone up the other end, won a corner and, and got the goal from us. Yeah, it, it's tough because you, you know, like I say, you'll know more than me in terms of what it was like as a, as a neutral. I, I think both teams have quality. I think um, both teams probably cancelled each other's quality out to a certain degree. They pressed us and stopped us playing and we wanted to do likewise, likewise to them. Um, so, from the side, from our perspective, I don't think it looks the best game, but I think it's two two good teams, two teams that um, have a chance. Um, again, concentrating on us, like I said, we we've got to, especially this time of year, especially the pitch of fairness is in, in great nick. It wasn't too good nick yesterday, but we're going to Halifax on Tuesday, which they've played in it today, and the forecast is not great. We're going to Dover next Saturday. Saw their game last week. That that pitch will not be in a, in a, in a, in a good place. So you, you have to be functional at times, um, and if we're going to be successful, that's something that we want to be able to adapt to and, and still win games. And, and we've done that today, which is uh, massive and pleasing to uh, to bounce back from last week's result. Even after we went one 0 up, we still had chances. But I mean, the biggest the biggest thing really seemed it was such a professional performance from all the lads just to you know, keep 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 that lead and especially towards the end we really seemed to defend them defend them well. I think sometimes it, it, it shouldn't be because we also want to be successful and at the right end of the table. But we put it on them a little bit that we knew we were going to have to defend well today, and it's not rocket science. That if you if, I said, if we keep a clean sheet, I think we'll win the game. Um, that was the case. I, I can say that in every game, but I, I think just showing some stuff around Sutton, um, what their front four are about, what they do, the pressure they put you under, the threat they pose, has consciously sort of made our switch on. Yes, there were some lapses. Listen, I was, I was shouting over to Fergie a couple of times in the start of the start of the second half where. Um, had your, had your boys got, got away from him and, and, and posed us a, a threat aside from the odd occasion I thought we were like I say fantastic and um, it's difficult to say thoroughly deserved a, 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 to win we've won a tight game like I say I don't think we deserved to um, to lose last week but, but we did um, so like I say to get back uh, to winning ways so quickly against the good side is a really really big plus going into a, a tough run of games there was a lot of stuff on online before the game saying that this these types of game the Vic would have been absolutely packed out in the atmosphere would have been unbelievable. So to win for the fans in, against a really good team and put up to second just makes it even better. Yeah, absolutely. We're, we're in a a really really privileged position to be able to be carrying on playing. Um, people are stuck at home having to watch it on um, the streams that you get lots of stick for. Um, <laughs> but we, like I say, we're, we're lucky, um, and, and hopefully that continues. And if we can provide 
a little bit of happiness to some people that are away watching screaming at the telly, um, which means that they enjoy an extra beer on a on a Saturday night and have a sore head on a Sunday morning. Then, then brilliant. Um, we we just hope it's not too long before things gradually gradually turn around. I say can't thank the the supporters enough for for what they have done, um, and like I say, hopefully we get to appreciate it further down the line. Another positive from today, Gary Little back on the bench and such a positive thing for the for the whole squad really. Yeah, like, we're in a good place, like I say, in terms of in terms of bodies. Um, we need to be because we've lots of games coming up. We've like I say, we've a few little niggles, we've got to cut a few out of the game today, we'll have to see how they how they recover. Um, we've obviously got a suspension as a result of today's game, we've got Moles who's, who's suspended from his, his red card, so lads will be called upon and we play Saturday, Tuesday every uh, every week in, in February, so it is a tough ask, but a, a tough ask is an opportunity and there'll, there'll be opportunities for other players to, to step in and obviously with them all being, being fit and, and, and being um, raring to go, um, hopefully they can take them. And just finally, as you said about people stepping in, we head to Halifax on Tuesday, fingers crossed, as we've just seen the weather forecast and it doesn't, doesn't look great, but doesn't. <laughs> if the game does go on, is it just more of the same? Yeah, I, I, listen, I think we go there, you only got to look at, last week they changed their game and went to Bromley to play on the 3G and didn't play at home, they've played at home today, I think the forecast is due to be minus three overnight and snow forecast for, for Tuesday, so regardless of <coughs> hopefully the game goes ahead, we, we can get it on, if it goes ahead I'd, I wouldn't expect to turn up there on the pitch being fantastic conditions so you have to you have to deal with that, like I said, this, this league's full of challenges uh, and a different challenge every week be that philosophy of team you play against, um, like say style of play, shape, um, physical, passing um, and, and, and pitches, grass, water, 3G, so you get all sorts of all sorts of challenges and you'll be judged at the end of the season on who deals best with those those challenges, hopefully we're, we're up for that, we'll certainly be up for it um, motivationally wise and, and mentally and hopefully we can go and, uh, and put in a performance, if we can play well brilliantly if we have to grind out a result and um, and win the game and get ourselves another clean sheet, then I'll, I'll absolutely take that. Dave, thanks very much. Cheers, thank you.